So I just want to make a final note um, on the, uh, the definition of recession, which has been an issue that I know many of you have uh, reported on. Um, as Secretary Yellen said on Sunday, uh, two negative quarters of GDP growth is not uh, the technical definition of recession. It's not the definition that economists have traditionally uh, relied on. Uh, there is an organization called the National Bureau of Economic Research, uh, and what they do is they look at a broad range of data in deciding uh, whether or not a recession has occurred. That is the process that economists and administrations have used for uh, years and decades uh, to identify when a recession uh, has occurred. Uh, but from the president's perspective, uh, putting that technical question aside, the most important question economically is uh, whether uh, working people and middle class families have more breathing room, they have more job opportunities, uh, their wages are growing up, uh, going up in a, in a stable way, and they're able to afford the important things in their lives, um, from food and gasoline also to health care. Uh, and prescription drugs uh, and afford education for themselves and their children and otherwise. And that is what has animated his economic strategy. It's what his focus is on. It's why you have seen him as focused as he has been on trying to work to take policy actions that will lower prices and lower costs for American families in this moment, uh, even as we work to bring inflation down uh, and, and, and effectuate that tr transition uh, to a more uh, stable and steady state. So with that, 